typical morning for one Cleveland father quickly turns into a terrifying encounter. Good evening, I'm Joshua. And I'm Latricia Thomas. William Young had just stepped out of his door to go to work when he stared down the barrel of a gun. Sam Luther explains what happened and why police believe this armed robbery was far from isolated. I don't expect to get anything back now. William Young used the push to start feature to run his car early Tuesday morning. Around 4 a.m. he was met with an unexpected encounter. He told me then to give me uh, his, uh, give him my keys, phone, wallet. Young says two men approached him in this driveway, robbing him at gunpoint, then drove away with his car, a 2013 Nissan Altima. And while he was telling me to back up, I was just waiting to get shot. His girlfriend, Brittany Fight, remembers Young pounding on the window asking for help just moments after and I just hear boom, 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 boom. the car found wrecked a few hours later. Cleveland police say this wasn't an isolated incident. We had one juvenile and three adult males that were from Knoxville and Chattanooga that actually planned to come to Cleveland to burglarize vehicles. Sergeant West says several vehicles on Brooks Edge, Tomahawk Circle and Peerless Road were targeted. Now tonight, a Cleveland family losing their sense of safety in a place they call home. Yeah, we've considered possibly Possibly moving in Cleveland, Sam Luther, News Channel 9. Cleveland police say two of those suspects are in custody while two others are still on the run. If you know any information, you're asked to call them right away.